It's all about fishing. It's all about hunting. It's all about the great outdoors. And it's all about Outdoors with Captain Roy and Cheryl. Good morning. Welcome aboard. I'm Captain Roy. And I'm Cheryl Little. And we're at the Little Lodge today. The Little Lodge. <laughs> well, no telling where we like we out show up next That's week. That's right. We got a lot to do, Cheryl. Uh, Lake Seminole fishing report guy Jody Wells. And God, Jody Wells, he says that the brim are still on the beds. White bass and black bass have turned it on, and so have the yellow flies. <laughs> Let me tell you, <laughs> yellow flies have turned it on every, uh, about any, any place you go. Cheryl, there's something odd about yellow flies and blackberries. When the blackberries, wild blackberries I'm talking about, when they get ripe, yellow flies are going to bite. <laughs> <laughs> and, when the, and when the blackberries are gone, the yellow flies are gone. I'll be. No telling. Blackberries are ripe, folks. <laughs> they will bite you. Sure, we're going to, uh, uh, we've got some fishing to do, and we're going to give away uh, two a fishing trip at the end of the show out of our sweepstakes. So you you want to stay tuned. We, we'll be giving away a, a fishing trip with Captain Roy. Yeah. And a fishing trip on the Gemini Queen. That's a deep sea fishing trip. We're going to uh, we're going to give away one ticket. Yeah. So let's uh, do some fishing. Okay. Jeff uh, Tidwell Tindall and I went into East Bay and we had a we had a blast. So stay tuned after the break, we'll go fishing. Brooks Bait and Tackle. We're located at 6910 Highway 22 in Callaway. We've expanded our saltwater tackle. DOAs, gulps, trout trailers, bomber king rigs. We've increased our zoom selection. We have over 55 different brim poles to choose from. We have the biggest selection of H&H &H spinners in town. We have earthworms, redworms, green worms, and wigglers. We have live shrimp. We have ice by the scoop, by the bag, $1.25 a bag, 10 pound bag, $1.25 a bucket, or 25 cents a scoop. Most importantly, we offer non-ethanol gas. Brooks Bait and Tackle is your one-stop shop. Whether it's removing dangerous trees or planting new ones, Gulf Coast Tree Specialists can help you with all your tree care needs. Sometimes your tree problems are too big for you to handle. Even if it seems impossible to remove your tree, our licensed, bonded, and insured professionals can always find a way for a fair and reasonable price. We can also remove large and unusual items from your property. And our certified arborists can analyze root problems and evaluate structural issues. At Gulf Coast Tree Specialists, we would like to thank you for your continued support and service over the past 20 years and look forward to serving you in the future. Hi folks, I'm BJ with BJ's Marine. This has been a family owned and operated business for over 20 years. We pride ourselves in the sales and service of Nissan and Tahatsu outboards. At BJ's we have factory trained and authorized technicians for Nissan and Tahatsu. We also repair most any make or model outboard. Call or come by BJ's Marine Service at 1317 Transmitter Road. And folks, we really do appreciate your business. What do you expect from your lawn this year? Now, during Kubota's Great Expectations sales event, you can get a great deal on the all-new Kubota Commander Zero-Turn Mower. With Kubota, expect professional performance and a full four-year, 300-hour factory warranty. Raise your expectations about your lawn with the Kubota Commander. Now, for a special introductory price of $44.99 with zero down and 0% 0 financing for 36 months. See and save on all Kubota tractors and equipment at Soil Tractor today. You don't care whether you're on TV or not. It don't bother me. <laughs> Jeff Tenda. We're over here in East Bay. We're going to try to catch us a redfish or a speckle trout or Jeff or whatever bite. Yeah. Might be a flounder, you can't ever say. And uh, we'll be just about, just about a good son of it. Son was coming up earlier to, all along. Now I'm going to start leaving dock about 5 o'clock instead of 5 30. I put these up here on this point, see if we see what we can do, Jeff. I just gonna start off fishing a new penny, right? Jeff, hold that thing up and let's look at it. That new penny. 
deal with it today. Uh, and I'll start out with the paddle tail. And we'll see if, we, if they were about one or the other of them. They feel pretty good with the oh. nest, nest behind you. What you got, a red? Lisa. I just let him go out there and have fun with him a little while. He'll wear it. Uh oh. Now that's what you call the agony of defeat, Jeff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. Jeff, you got him over there again. Yeah, see if we can bring this one in the boat. You're going to put him in the boat. Well, as long as he's running around out there, we've got a chance. Now he gets slack up. <laughs> that must be a big one, too. Yeah. Well, he's got that rod bent there. Make him run. He still on there? Yeah, he's there. Oh, there he goes. He done decided he didn't want to come to the boat for a minute. <laughs> Yeah, that's where I want him off out there. <laughs> 20, 30 yards. He's evidently a full size one. Oh, yeah. Couldn't go <laughs> long as your leg, Jeff. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's you and him now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go see who's the best man. <laughs> I see another one strike up there right where I. Right where you caught that one. There you go. There you go. Go ahead and run with it. <laughs> I did that one day. I had a lady got one on like that, Jeff, and every time he get up close to the boat, I'd stomp the boat. <laughs> and she said, Captain, don't do that when you, when you every time you do that, he runs off. I said, That's exactly what we got what we want him to do for a while. You come up left in a little bit, we we can catch him. That's about a five or ten, ten minute when you got on there. Think you got him wore out now? <laughs> All right, by the time he gets the boat, we'll find out. There you go. I tell you what, I'm going to pick up and pick the motor up and get the trolling motor in. Yeah, Think you about got him wore out. The only thing left now for him to snag on to the transducer. Yeah. Can you turn him around? We'll put him in this net. Oh, all right, Jeff, he's all yours. There we go. <laughs> I can't wait like pick him up or not. That's a fine red fish. Hit the old, hit the old chicken. They like that. I like that uh, electric chicken. Yep. That's a pretty one there, Jeff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. And we're going to put him right back where we, where we found him, right, Jeff? Yeah, right. He'll be here another day. Yeah, we'll catch him again. There he goes. Real pretty, Jeff. Yeah. Jeff's going to see if he can catch another one here around these dogs and cook by over. That's a good place in there, Jeff. Go around that dog. There would be a big old redfish up there. Jeff got one on. We was fishing along, we weren't catching anything. I cranked up the motor, it's already moving the boat, more than grabbed it, didn't he, didn't he, Jeff? Yes, sir. Pretty good fish. Swing him around while out of the sun, I'll take the picture. Yeah, that's a pretty trout. You, you can reach that, can't you? Oh, yeah. You're going to lose him. You're going to lose him. Oh, he got him in the boat. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Good try, Jeff. I think the captain got one on. Those pretty fish, aren't they, Jeff? Oh, yeah. Yeah, pretty. Jeff, did I call him right? You called him right on. <laughs> 
I said, I bet you get a bite that if I just caught one of you. Tide just turned out and they started to bite a little bit now. The speck's been kind of slow this morning, but with a biting. But I like to fish the outgoing tide, yeah. Yeah, it seems to go pretty well. That's, that's a nice trout there. Can you, can you, you're not going to keep him anyway, so just pick him up. We haven't kept anything, just throw a little ball back. Yeah, man. Yeah, right here. There we go. Fine trout there, yeah. Well, the captain finally caught one, Jeff. Yeah. Finally caught one. Nice trout there. Alright, your time now. Go to catch one right there. I decided I'd try a white shrimp under a float and they bite him too. Both of us have got some road responsibilities this afternoon. Yes, sir. There we go. Yeah, man. Yes, I did catch one more. That's about a good trout. Good size trout right there. Yes, sir. Well, we can't go home and we'll catch one like that because this is another one out there, have we, That's right. <laughs> How many times have you heard the big ones are in shallow water or there are more squirrels than you can shake a stick at way up the river? But the problem is you can't get there with your propeller-driven outboard. Meet Joe Riley, Problem Solver, and the Tahatsu Jet Drive Outboard. With Tahatsu Jet Drive, you can get where no man, or should I say, no outboard has ever been. With stick steering power, Tahatsu Jet Drive, and a rhino boat, you can show your fishing and hunting buddies you mean business. See them at Joe's Motor Service, Hartford, Alabama, near Dothan. Sun Jammers and Hobie Kayaks provide the ultimate lightweight fishing platforms that will offer anyone what they need when it comes time to hit the water. Hobie Kayaks' commitment to innovation, quality, and owner satisfaction is unparalleled in the industry, and the service and selection provided by Sun Jammers Water Sports is top notch. So when it's time for you to go kayak fishing, there's only two names you need to remember, Sun Jammers Water Sports and Hobie Kayaks. Sun Jammers Water Sports is located on the west end of Panama City Beach and online at sunjammers.com. The Register Meat Company was founded over 71 years ago by Pappy Register. Register's premier product is their country-style sausage. It is 100% pure pork and hog casings with their secret seasonings. It's packaged in mild hot and I mean hot. Their sugar cure bacon is smoked for hours. And Register's premium hams are pumped with their special ham pump. If you're in the Cottondale area, stop by their country store and ask about their Pick 5 program and their veggie bush. Look for Register's Meats at your local grocery. Tell you what I like about corn. I like the food, I like the price, I like the quality, I like the quantity of it. But what I like most about corn, steak, and egg is I like that friendly atmosphere that I always find when I dine out there. It's owned and operated by Linda and Willie Corn. They are the original and they're open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and they're breakfast out of this world. And my favorite is the world famous Corn Heavenly Hash. Corn, steak, and egg, 804 South Tyndall Parkway.
John Farr. Yes, sir. We have arrived back in Bay County. <laughs> Enjoy the, the Memorial Day week. Yeah, I wasn't coming down here Memorial Day. <laughs> now, I'll tell you what, John, on Memorial Day, I didn't go, didn't leave the dock, but I did go by some docks and the cars were parked both sides of the highway. Right. All, around them. You know, I, I just read it, rather not go when it's that way, but a lot of people came down and it's, it, uh, still a lot of people down. They'll be down all the week, but we out here early this morning. I can still see the lights tend to fill off over here, John. Yes, sir. We made it early, but the wind got up already, John. So you got, we, you got me up before breakfast today. Did I? Yeah, you did. Well, I hate that, John. <laughs> no, no. We got to get. We got an early start, and so if they're gonna buy it, we we're not gonna miss out on anything, John. That's by right. by the early fishing. Let's see what we can do here. All right, John, number one there. That's number one. Let's see if we can see if there's number two out there. I bet there is. John, you fishing with the with the glow. With the glow. Deal away glow shad tail. I think I'll try I think I'll try the white shrimp under a float. Mm -hmm. See what that'll do. That's what you get. <laughs> That's a nice try, John. Don't lose it. That's a keeper. That's our keeper. That's a that was a keeper, John. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> hey, that's a net right there, John. <laughs> John, you got a red on, huh? Yes, sir. I don't see him out there now. Oh. I just saw him. Okay, he's not off out there. There he is. Yeah. Yeah. You, are you gaining anything on it? <laughs> no, I can't. Yeah. Are you making a little headway now? Make a little headway. Which way are you trying to go? Around the boat. Around the boat. Get away from this boat. Redfish. Oh, he came off. Yeah. I got to try to get the motor up, y'all. We hung on the motor. Get out of there, maybe on the transducer over there. I don't know what it is, John. It must be. He's, he's a big fish, is all I know. John, I believe you're gonna whip. I believe you're gonna whip him now. I don't know who's gonna give up first. <laughs> must be a fine red. I got the net. You can make him come this way a little bit. Looks like he's doing kind of what he wants to do now. <laughs> we'll bring him around on that side. <laughs> no, he decided to go back on the other side, John. <laughs> this is what a red fish. There's the net. If you can slide him up this way, we'll put that big boy in there. He is a dandy. Now, I can't pick him up. He's going to have to pick him up. Oh, yeah, come on. Good. Is that a red? John, yes, you did a good job putting that one in the boat. He's a nice one. That is a nice one. Yes, sir. Ready? All right. There he goes back. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Redfish. You put up a fine fight, didn't oh, he you? Did. <laughs> yeah, he's out there with we'll catching next time, too. Come on, Captain Roy. Got him? Okay. okay. Oh, yeah. 
Yes, sir. How about a flounder there, John? Yes, sir. Your wife, your wife likes flounder, don't she? a little bit bigger, I didn't know. <laughs> she likes flounder. Where are you running? Well, you finally caught a fish there, John. Got out of the redfish there. Trout. Let me get the net. I'm going to take it off. Okay. Okay. That's a trout, Captain. That's a nice one, isn't it, John? I'm telling you, that's a good fish there. That's what I want, I want you to catch one now, just like <laughs> a little bigger. <laughs> okay, Captain Roy, that's a nice one there. That is a good one. That's good. Somebody doesn't got a hold to him, though. He got some yeah, injured, got places, some... injured places on him. Yeah. yeah. Captain got another one there, not a bad trout, on the Arkansas Blue. That's a good trout, ain't it, John? Yes, sir. Well, we ought to get the lid under. Can you handle it? That is a fine trout, John. Come here, buddy. That is a good one, John. Can you get the lid under? Yeah. Come in, Daddy. Get it close to him, he's afraid of it, and he might have been netted before, John. Oh, you got it. Man, that's a fine trout, John. Yes, sir. That mean, that's a good one. That's Arkansas Glow. <laughs> Arkansas Glow. Arkansas Glow. Yeah. When you only have one shot, one chance, there are only two names to remember, Browning and C&G Sporting Goods. C&G carries the full line of Browning rifles, shotguns, handguns, knives, and clothing, like the Browning X-Boat. Every component of the Browning X-Boat works together to deliver the most critical feature, total accuracy. Visit C&G Sporting Goods today because you don't want to miss that one shot. For everything you need on or off the water, visit the Panama City and St. Andrews Marinas. Both locations provide you with easy access boat slips, ramps, fuel, bait, and tackle. Come visit our ship stores and see our unique nautical gifts and clothing. Or just relax with a cool drink and grab a snack while watching the boats come in. Don't forget that Mariner on your shopping list. Come by and see our unique nautical gifts, cards, and clothing at the ship store at Panama City or St. Andrews Marina. Panama City and St. Andrews Marinas. Everything you remember and so much more. Hi, this is Nate with Mexico Beach Marina. Remember, we're a key dealer for Yamaha Outboards as well as a five-star certified service department dealer for Edgewater Power Boats. Our marina store still offers all your latest tackle, live bait, bulk ice, ethanol-free fuel, and slip rentals. And our beach store has everything you need for your day at the beach with Guy Harvey, Salt Life, Sperry, Top Sider, Hook and Tackle, Bimini Bay, and much more. You can check out our website at MexicoBeachMarina.com. Check out our Facebook page. So come on down to beautiful Mexico Beach and come on in and say hi. DOA Lures, the unfair advantage. Mark Nichols molded the world's first plastic shrimp at his kitchen table in 1989. Today, DOA Lures offers four sizes of shrimp in 54 colors, along with a complete line of lures for both inshore and offshore use, as well as freshwater. And what I like the most about DOA Lures, they are American made. DOA Lures available at your local tackle retailer or go online at doalures.com. Good to see John back in town. <laughs> and you know, sir, we only was able to squeeze in this one trip. John, uh -huh. I, I'm sorry about that. We'll try, try to fish at least twice next time you come down. <laughs> but uh, yeah, John, uh, he don't keep, he don't keep redfish, and uh, we had a good day as usual. Yeah. Sure, we got to move on. We're going to give away two fishing trips today, and the first one that we're going to give away is a fishing trip 
That's a six hour offshore deep sea fishing trip. We call it Captain Roy Day. We try to do this every fall. Uh, I mean, every, every year on the Gemini Queen. Yep. And uh, we're going to draw for a winner that's going to go fishing with me on the Gemini Queen. And it's going to be Michelle Mayo. Um, and Michelle's out of Alpha. So congratulations, Michelle Mayo. You get to go offshore fish and get you some snapper. And Michelle, I do need to, for you to call me by Monday a.m. Call me now if you're watching the show. Give me a call. I'll make sure uh, that you want to go. And uh, if you don't, we'll get we'll get somebody else. But if this is, I need to know today or by Monday morning right. if you want to go go deep sea fishing on the Gemini Queen. Now, All right. we, who wants to go fishing with Captain who is Roy? The lucky person to go fishing with Captain Roy is going to be Jewel Shelton. So, congratulations to Jewel Shelton. You get to go fishing with Captain Roy, you and a friend. So, very good. Jewel Shelton. Jewel, she had only won a canoe trip. So yeah. She's had a good, she's had a good day, good she, year. Yes, yeah, she has. Again, give me a call, Jewel, and we'll set up a time to go fishing. Right. If, tell them how to enter sweepstakes. We're going to be drawing just about every show okay. of our sweepstakes. And what you want to do is you can email us at uh, outdoors at captainroy.com. If you don't have a computer, give us a call at 850-722-9382 to win her. And also make sure you go to our webpage, CaptainRoy.com, and it's got all the latest. I finally have gotten caught up on YouTube. Great. How far behind had I been? Weeks. So um, all the shows now are current and up to date on YouTube, and you can view those now. So. Sure. Do, do you believe this? I, I got. Uh, sure, you do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we. Uh, I had an entry from Texas. Oh wow. Some place in Texas. They wanted to enter the. Uh, a sweepstakes and win a canoe trip. They're coming down to Panama City and said they watch our show from YouTube. Excellent. Very so, good. Uh, thank you all for watching the show, folks. We've got to get out of here and uh, remind you to tune in again next Saturday at the same time and remember to always try to be as good to him as he is to you. Good day. <laughs>